garlic honey. Look at this goodness. Look at this goodness. Garlic honey. Well groomed, as Cheryl says. Well groomed is the key. Yeah, don't go messy, right? It's fantastic. Yes, yes, yes. Let's do another one. <laughs> but we're going to do another one of these. We're going to do garlic, ginger, and turmeric. Okay? So fantastic. Let's bring this baby over. Let's put a layer of honey down there at the bottom. Nicholas Chicho, Chicho beer playlist. The first link is the video name you named. The second link is facial hair uh, playlist. Awesome, awesome. Thank you very much, Nicholas. Thank you very much. And uh, check this out. Like when I started making videos, like mid two thousands, right? I had one person, one friend that was into uh social networks videos and stuff like this he was working for a big company and whatnot he looked at my math videos and he said oh chicho look you phenomenal work like he was like wow your math videos are incredible so good so good but one thing you have to do you have to cut shave the beard i go what he goes shave the beard uh People don't like beards. Companies, you know, they get turned off by beards and stuff like this. You'll get more hits if you shave, if you're clean cut. I looked down at my laugh. I go, fuck, I'm not doing this for hits. I'm doing it because I love doing what I'm doing and I love my fucking beard. I'm not going to shave so Disney can pick up my content. It's not going to happen. There are times I do have videos, math videos, where I don't have facial hair, but I'm not going to do it because facial hair bad. I'm going to do, I'm going to shave my beard when I feel like it. And there's no way I'm going to be not having a beard and making videos. So, and at that time, there weren't too many people with facial hair. They were like, oh, facial hair bad. We're, keep, keep in mind, we came out of 9-11, right? And... The Western world was a war in Afghanistan and half of them invaded Iraq. And it was a time where there was a huge propaganda campaign against facial hair of all things. For me, I didn't care. The corporate propagandists and those who fear something can go suck an egg. <laughs> <laughs> to put it nicely. <laughs> Trident on sensor tube. I hope you're having a good day, my friend. Indeed, indeed. Playing with garlic and honey. Awesome. And live streaming and chit-chatting with people. Life is pretty good, man. Life is pretty good. Life is sweet. And if I see garlic like this, if there's a little blemish there and stuff, I do cut that off. So every layer now, I'm going to put a garlic, ginger, and turmeric, okay? Oh, and Cheryl says, oh, and take care of the skin underneath the beard. Coolio. I'm not sure if I really do anything with the skin underneath the beard. <laughs> I'm not a huge oil person. Like, I don't oil the beard, oil the facial hair, or anything. Uh, I just, I just make sure I'm clean. Come Uh, how many jars am I making? I'm just going to make two jars with the medicinal stuff, garlic and honey and stuff. And then we're going to get back into just jarring honey because I want to have a whole bunch of jarred honey. Uh, you know, if we're going to go to some some someone's house, we can take it as a gift. Um, and it's for our use as well, right? We don't want to have a big bucket of honey sitting on the counter 
because we use honey on it a daily basis right Cheryl Chicho do you use soap or cleaner when you wash your face uh, if so you're taking care of the skin yeah 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 that's what I do I do I do use soap for sure for sure yeah then stay clean people <laughs> yeah 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 for sure for sure and good soap you know we're not using crappy crappy soap we're using good soap and the good soap stuff my partner takes care of in general I found I, I found that women tend to be much wiser when it comes to skincare than men in general in general okay oh god Arsenal last minute winner against Lutton Town to win 4-3 damn that's a high scoring game okay turmeric and ginger gang we're gonna do turmeric and ginger I got a couple other types of garlic here but I'm not gonna use these ones I'm just gonna stick with those ones uh, let me put these guys here so I'm gonna need here's a turmeric right I'm gonna need a spoon because I need to clean this off. I'm gonna bring another, uh, another smaller cutting tray. Thinner, uh, we got little spoons, but those ones are dirty. I didn't feel like washing up. So, ginger, right? So, I'm just gonna peel off the like, like that, right? Just peel off the skin on it. And ginger is strong, so I'm not 100% sure how much ginger we're going to use, but... amazing smell right so here's the ginger right so let me get this wipe just a little bit more clean
I'm not sure if it's a good idea just to cut it up like this or throw chunks in there, but I'm going to cut it. I'm not going to cut it too thin though. Ah, it's okay. We'll do another round. Okay. Let's put a little bit in there. Okay. That's the ginger. Let's do turmeric. Here's turmeric. Okay. Should I use this one? Bigger one. Let's use a bigger one. I want to use a bigger one. So. Oh. Look at the color on that. Awesome. Awesome. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Beautiful. Now be careful with turmeric because it stains. Okay. Smell is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Right. Just amazing. And turmeric, amazing for inflammation. And inflammation is something that everyone deals with, right? So if you're having aches and pains and uh, you have inflammation issues, turmeric is an amazing natural medicine. It should be part of everybody's diet. Really, turmeric should be part of everybody's diet. Right? Just beautiful, just beautiful. Right. Just take a handful. Take a look. See that so just making a layer of that and I'm gonna put some couple of spoons fulls of honey on it okay let me just put this guy over here and then we'll put garlic turmeric ginger again repeat right all the way to the top Apologies if I'm not reading the chat, gang. Uh, uh, this honey. What do I usually eat the honey with? Uh, Marco is asking. Uh, this honey with? This is the first time I'm doing this. Uh, but honey, I use yeah, everywhere. Uh, just with toast, with foods, with yogurt, uh, honey and uh, lemon, uh, warm water. Uh, just honey almost everyday honey 
the one Matt first time chat on Twitch. Uh, hey Chicho, one of my favorite videos of yours when you showed some art you had bought at a gallery, uh, all by the same guy. Yeah, yeah, can't quite remember his name, uh, but he did uh, friends with wood. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wondering if you've bought uh, much artwork since. Um, mm -hmm. I bought some original comic book art pages that we've. Uh, you can find them in the comic book haul videos. Um, but I haven't bought too much art since then. Like just, uh, what do you call it? Uh, paintings and stuff. Uh, most of my art buying has been comic books in general. Uh, but I do like those, uh, those, those ones we bought were super good. Super good. Unfortunately, I found out the 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 artist was very pro injections so uh i have you know i won't be buying anything from him again um, but i did like his work there was another artist that really liked and he was anti-injections anti-mandates and stuff not anti-injections but anti-tyranny and uh, at some point i will buy some of his artwork he does a lot of work with wood uh, beautiful pieces but expensive expensive uh, so I haven't had the opportunity to uh, indulge myself on that level didn't you do a math video on hanging one of those uh, art pieces yeah 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 elder god for sure <laughs> doing measurements and stuff we got to get back into more math videos and we will be now that I got the word. This one's going to be more garlicky, I think. We see. Nicholas. Uh, also, Miss Balloon Hands. Chicho will be doing relationships stream soon. Plenty of support and good advice there. Yeah, we've done a few of those. I can't remember how many we've done, Nicholas, actually. Uh, but let's say in a couple of weeks, we do a relationship stream. The odds are uh, this coming weekend... Well, yeah, this coming weekend, I won't be doing a live stream, but the following weekend, I think we can set it up or the weekend after. Okay. But during uh, the Christmas holidays, we do. We do. Okay. For sure. Just enough, All right? Just enough. Let's put a couple of more spoonfuls in there. put three spoonfuls and more garlic so this is the last of that bunch of garlic okay Totally missed uh, some discussion going on about relationships and stuff. But 
Marco P. on Censortube. Uh, what were your thoughts on the COVID uh, uh, vaccinations? Uh, freedom of choice. That was my my thoughts. I fell in there. Uh, we put out a lot of content regarding that, Marco P. Some of the stuff we couldn't put on Censortube. So that should give you an idea uh, what I thought about it. And I 100% supported the Canadian truckers. Yeah, Cinnamon Honey would be amazing. Indeed, indeed. Yeah, Cinnamon Honey would be so good. I mean, we're not going to jar everything. We, got, we went through one, two. This is the third bucket or fourth bucket we're going through. Third bucket. And I got, we got six more buckets. So maybe uh, we'll do another honey jarring video uh, in a month or so. has been live for one hour and so oh so the so the stream did cut off so it's going to be two-parter maybe i'll see i'm saving the the video as well hopefully the save version will be good baby nice yeah i agree with everything nicholas said pain and suffering is in inevitable it makes us stronger and we learn a bunch about ourselves. 100%, 100%. Mixie on sensor tube. Salutations, welcome to our live stream. Smells amazing, by the way, gang. Cut up some more turmeric. some more ginger let's do a little bit more I like playing with food this stuff is awesome <laughs> Alex Suviel this is quite satisfying to watch we're making something we're creating something and we're playing around with food like and honey food and honey well food is honey well honey is food to remember to create a couple of smaller jars of these for our yearly auction for next year yeah sound like a plan
Looks nice, eh? No, I'm not in the... Well, the good cigar I smoked was... The good tobacco I smoked was uh, a blunt smoking a, smoking our own uh, homegrown tobacco. But uh, I'm not in the smoking season. I'm doing uh, cigar smoking by the season. Uh, so come springtime, I'm going to hit up the cigars again. But for now, staying away from the cigars. Uh, it gives me a break. Uh, make sure I don't get addicted. And... Uh, I don't smoke inside the house, so it's nice uh, during the springtime, just go outside and sit on the patio and have a smoke. Cheryl Chicho, how do you get your uh, crystallized honey into a runny state? Uh, I had to do this for the cookie recipe I made this weekend, and it uh, look uh, forward with warm, uh, it, it look, uh, it took forever with warm, uh, what I do is um, uh, the kettle, the way I make tea, the double pot system. Uh, so what I do is, here, hold on, let me, I'll show you. Come on. Here, let me show you. Watch this. the staining of uh, turmeric so I do my tea Persian style right I have this on the kettle on the stove top and I put this on top so when I want to liquefy the honey I take this off and I put a honey in a bowl and I put it on top of this and just turn up the heat a little bit if I'm in a rush and it melts the honey, uh, liquefies the honey. Because I, I have tea going the whole time, right? So, and then I put the teapot back on and my warm tea is going, so it's really good. We gotta hit up this other garlic. We gotta hit up this one. <laughs> Nicholas, one of my favorite videos was Chicho Tima. That was fun. That was fun. The one Matt, as you're a huge comic fan, what are your thoughts on comic movies today? Do you think it's oversaturated? Oh, for sure oversaturated, and there's a lot of crap being made. But there's also some amazing stuff being made, right? So it's Hollywood. Like, there's some really good stuff, and there's some bad stuff. Uh, like, for example, Doom Patrol TV series is really good, trippy, right? A Legion TV series was absolutely amazing, right? Uh, What's a crappy one? Like, we're gonna get, I'm gonna get burned for this, but I thought the Wonder Woman movie, I just watched the first one, I just, boo, didn't even finish it, I couldn't, we couldn't stand it. Or did we finish it? I can't remember if we finished it or not, right? Watchmen, sorry, Alan Moore, really loved Watchmen. So there's a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, give it a try, Cheryl, it's good. Reserve, mind blown by this method. <laughs> Seems good. <laughs> nice. The hunt, the garlic is sort of sinking in, settling in. Yeah, Gal Godot is terrible. Horrendous. Horrendous. Her acting skills are zero. Like the worst actor 
in human history. Like her 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 look for for being perplexed was her look for being happy was her look for being uh about, about to get in a fight was, <laughs> was her look of eating ice cream was like <laughs> like brutal brutal absolutely brutal so bad uh the one math marvel is particular i feel are good for quality over uh quantity over quality which is uh, such a shame indeed indeed like some of the more recent marvel i couldn't watch them it was like so bad so bad ah cte those crystal those asmr videos about crystals so soothing awesome i love crystals i lucked out my partner has a huge crystal rock mineral collection right she worked in a crystal store for a number of years her collection blows away mine right but mine was a lot of a lot of it was field and it was hands-on right i did buy some of it i guess but mom and pop places middle of nowhere Who's, which one is Brie, oh God, which one is Brie Larson who's Brie Larson I don't know who that is I've never hit a stream before oh Mixie how are you doing on Sensor 2 I've never hit, never hit a stream before I've only watched videos of the alcohol making it's my it's my favorite yeah liqueurs all the way Magnificent, right? Just magnificent. Look at this. Look, look at the color on that, right? Is it gonna focus? There it is. Nice, nice. The only movies like Nicholas, the only movies that should be watched every Christmas is Home Alone. Uh, black and white movie about the guy. Uh, uh, oh man, I forget his name. Uh, uh, he owns the bank. Uh, Jim, oh man, what's it called? Jimmy Stewart? Jimmy Stewart. Uh, and I forget the name of the movie. What's it called? It's a Wonderful Life. Yeah, Elder God. It's a Wonderful Life. What an amazing movie. What an amazing movie. Right? I love it's a wonderful life. What have we got? We've got three more garlics. We're gonna put them in there. And then finish it off. Okay. Die Hard is really good too. Die Hard is really good, I agree. 
Die Hard is my Christmas movie. Seeing Hans Grober fall is a mince pie moment. <laughs> Fun. Fun. Ho ho ho. Ho 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 mofo Yippee ya ye Christmas pudding <laughs> Santa is a mushroom, yeah yeah yeah. The scan the Scandinavians, eh? And reindeer. Where's reindeer come from? What's the reindeer connection? Huh? What's the reindeer connection? The reindeer eat the amanita mascara, and they pee it on the the pee in the snow. The snow turns yellow, <laughs> and that pee is uh, filtered amanita, so it's not poisonous. And uh, you eat the reindeer pee. <laughs> Don't eat the yellow snow. That's intense. I can't stomach Elf. No matter. Oh, I've never even watched Elf. I've never even watched Elf. Ginger. Turmeric. We did good. We did good. Good. Uh, what do you call it? Uh, good portion. Nice. This looks beautiful. This looks beautiful. So this is going to ferment slowly. I'm not sure how long it's going to take to ferment, but we're going to be gassing it out. Uh, not on a daily basis, but maybe once a week we'll gas it out. Uh, probably more once we see the garlic fermenting. Okay. Nice. And we got. Check this out. So we use basically. Uh, almost five kilos for these two honeys two jars so so each one is about a uh, two and a half kilos of honey <clears throat> of honey right straight up garlic garlic turmeric and ginger right first time doing this but it should be very delicious huh? like this smells amazing amazing first time chat her her per derp her or derp her or derp hi chicho new to the stream what's in the honey uh this one is just garlic uh local organic local farm bought at a farmer's market garlic fantastic garlic this one is the same type of garlic and a little bit of another one that we bought locally and turmeric and ginger uh, fresh turmeric here's the turmeric that i cut i took took off a chunk of that and uh, ginger i took a like chunk off this one that much and it's basically going to be medicinal for us it's first time trying it so we're going to burp it um every now and then as the garlic foreman uh, as the garlic formants right and we should be able to see the garlic fermenting because it should it'll become darker right it'll become brown right it's like it'll be like this that my guess my guess is i don't think it'll go as dark well it might go as dark as this it should go as dark as this right this is like pickled garlic that i eat on a regular basis it i love it it tastes amazing right 
Um, and that's, that's sort of like medicine as well as food on a regular basis. Turmeric we use on a regular basis. These ones I think are going to be more medicinal. Okay. Uh, more medicinal. The one mat. Do you grow the garden? No, no. We bought it at a farmer's market. We bought it as farmer's market. Oh my God, is that honey? Indeed it is. Indeed it is. And this was just one bucket of... of these guys right and we bought we got nine buckets of these right so right now we've basically jarred one uh, two three got uh six more to go <laughs> we'll probably do during another stream okay during another stream because we've been going two and a half hours for this right nicholas now i am craving pickled onions mm, delicious delicious is the, uh in the black jar in the black jar in the black jar in the black jar where's the black jar i don't know black jar no this isn't the black jar this is our mic if that's what you're uh thinking about uh, the one maddie i'd love a good farmer's market harder to come by here uh in the city in uk is it here the, there are some which are really good they're really nice here uh it's, it, it used to be way cheaper uh but it's on the expensive side now on this on the on the expensive side now outro time outro time gang thank you very much for being here we got the word from elder god we got to do outro right and it's late in the uk gang thank you very much for being here gang on sensor tube gang on rumble gang on twitch if you want to know what this work is about, we're on Patreon, Substack, Subscribe Star. You can definitely follow the work there. We do have a Gilded server. You're definitely welcome to join us there. Join our community, share information. Talk freely. Okay, talk freely. We are live streaming on Twitch, on SensorTube, and on Rumble. And we'll see when we can start live streaming on BitChute and probably kick in Odyssey at the same time. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We do upload some of the audios of these live streams to soundcloud.com as a podcast, and those podcasts should be available on your favorite podcasting platform. We are on Twitter, Minds, VK, Gap, uh, Getter, and Substack Notes. And for all of you that are supporting this work, gang, thank you very much for the support. I hope you're enjoying the content. I hope you're enjoying life. I hope you're taking care of yourself. Eat well, gang. Eat well, read, get exercise. Be happy. Surround yourself with loving people. Okay. And uh, I hope, I hope, I hope that uh, you enjoy the last month of the year, last couple of three weeks of the year. Okay. And for those of you that are supporting this work, gang, salute for the support and to the mods. I hope you have a fantastic next week, couple of weeks probably. We'll be back to do more live streams. Bye, everyone.